Hi, quick vlog today about Python. A very quick thing about Python. I've noticed something today at the bookstore. I was, uh, the bookstore serves coffee. I go to the bookstore, I get some coffee, I sit down, relax, you know, kind of a nice environment. Anyhow, so I noticed that Microsoft had published books on Python programming. And uh, I thought this was interesting. I thought this was interesting because, as you know, Microsoft has its own programming languages, most notably a C Sharp, and then the VB.NET, which is kind of like just a, a different version of C Sharp. But when you have a company like Microsoft, they have their own languages. And when they do have their own languages, but they still publish books on other languages, I think that's significant. So they did have a book Microsoft Press did on Python programming. So that tells me that Microsoft has embraced Python. And if I recall, hold on, Microsoft, we do a search here. Yep, Microsoft Visual Studio, which is their IDE. Microsoft, by the way, traditionally, going back to the 90s, makes excellent, excellent IDEs, integrated development environments. I can't say how it compares to PyCharm, which is IntelliJ's, uh, IntelliJ's, which is JetBrains Python IDE, but Microsoft has integrated Python coding within Visual Studio. So that tells you something about, uh, about how Microsoft feels about Python. So there you go. Once again, as I've been saying in several other videos, Python is one of these great languages to learn because it's got such a wide use case, meaning it's used all over the place. So Microsoft is supporting it. Uh, Google uses Python. Um, you know, Microsoft's putting out books on Python. Uh, you can use Python for web and for scraping and for server automation and for, of course, AI and machine learning. So it's a good all-round language. Now, you know, this is not a commentary on the quality of Python. It's a good language. It's not the fastest. But even though Python doesn't run nearly as fast as other languages, it's so fast to program with and computers are so powerful that it doesn't matter. All right, that's it. That's just uh, a little something I, I noticed. I was walking by at a bookstore and... Oh, look at that. Microsoft Press, oh, Python, significant. So if you're humming and hawing about whether you should learn Python, yeah, it's a great language to learn because it's just so widely used. Is it the best language ever invented? No, but it might be in certain circumstances the best language to use. This just depends on what you're doing. So uh, that's it for now.